The small town of Perryton is shaken up after police arrested 30-year-old Dustin Mack, who made threats to commit a mass shooting like the one last week in Connecticut. We don't have the luxury of waiting anymore to figure out whether he's serious or not before we take action. And so in this case, we uh, that's what we did. We, we spent all our effort locating the suspect and located him and put him in jail. I've got three investigators out right now doing follow-up on that uh, on the investigation to see if we can determine more information about how creditable the threat was. Mac was turned in by his own mother who called police after a phone conversation the two had where he mentioned both the shooting in Connecticut and at the movie theater in Aurora, Colorado. He referenced both of those uh, incidents and uh, said that uh, they would be small compared to what he was planning to do here in Perryton. She was very concerned and considered the threat to be a creditable threat, threat and called us about it. Parents naturally have their concerns about the safety of their kids, but the superintendent addressed those today. Please rest assured that we have policies in place. We have policies in place for dealing with situations like this, you know, fire, tornado. We work with our, amongst ourselves as school personnel to come up with, with uh, procedures for taking care of these. We work with our local law enforcement. We work with regional planning committees in, in trying to to be ready for any kind of crisis that comes along. He said that the school personnel are just as concerned. All of these people that go out and become educators, they, they, they do it because they have a passion for kids. They don't want to see kids hurt. They don't want to see violence against kids. All of us have been just heartbroken since last Friday about what happened up there. And, and so it, it's very scary. Chanel Douglas, Pro News 7.